Here's a list of the top seven underrated Roblox games in 2024. If you want to find any of the links to these games, go check them out on my website below. The first game on the list is Motorcycle Mayhem. In Motorcycle Mayhem, your primary objective is to drive as far as possible and earn gears along the way. These gears act as a currency within the game. The gears are crucial as they allow you to purchase better motorcycles, upgrade engines, and a variety of other enhancements that improve your performance and experience. The controls are pretty straightforward, but offer a lot of depth. Use the WASD keys to move your motorcycle around, M to switch between automatic and manual, transmission mode, and control to perform a wheelie. To brake, use the shift key, and for a more immersive experience, you can switch to free cam. Overall, this game offers an exciting and engaging experience within, with its combination of simple controls and challenging objectives. You will have a lot of fun playing it and trying to achieve higher scores and better bikes and upgrades. The next game on the list is called Untitled Tag Game. From the title, you can probably guess it involves a classic game of tag, but it brings a lot more to the table. Especially when played with friends, this game offers over 11 different game modes, including classics like Freeze Tag, Infected Tag, and many more creative variations. Depending on the mode, you will be designated either as a tagger or a runner. If you're a tagger, your objective is to catch all the runners as quickly as possible to end the round. On the other hand, if you're a runner, your mission is to avoid getting tagged and stay free for as long as you can. As you run around the map, you'll come across coins scattered in various locations. Collecting these coins is crucial as they are used to purchase a range of exciting items from the in-game shop. The shop offers skins, emotes, and a plethora of other customizable options to enhance your gameplay experience. Additionally, you will earn more coins by winning rounds, allowing you to continuously upgrade and personalize your character. Overall, an untitled tag game is a blast to play with friends and the thrill of competitive tag. Next on the list is Shadovis or something like that. I actually don't really know how to say it, but it is a thrilling adventure game and role-playing experience on Roblox. In Shadovis, players embark on an epic journey filled with exploration, combat, and customization. The game features seven distinct realms, each with its own challenges and treasures to discover. As you venture through the realms, you will have the opportunity to collect loot, buy gear, enhancing your Roblox character's abilities and appearance. One of the key aspects of Shadovis is the collection of qubits, which are essential for gaining XP power-ups. The power-ups boost your character's strength, making you a formidable warrior capable of taking on your tougher enemies and more daunting quests. Crafting also plays a significant role in the game, allowing you to create unique items and weapons that suit your play style. Combat in Shadovis is dynamic and engaging, with a variety of unique weapons at your disposal. Each weapon comes with special moves that can turn the tide of battle in your favor, adding depth and strategy to the gameplay. Whether you prefer the brute force of a heavy sword or the agility of dual daggers, there's a weapon that fits your combat style. Next up is Aftermath, an immersive 3D open world zombie survival shooter game on Roblox. Set in a post-apocalypse world, Aftermath challenges players to survive by scavenging for guns and supplies, battling relentless zombies and outsmarting other players in a fight for survival. Currently in early access alpha, Aftermath offers both paid and free access options. Paid access grants you lifetime access to the game, ensuring that you can dive into the action anytime you want. Free access, on the other hand, is typically available on weekends, giving everyone a chance to experience the thrill of survival without any cost. As you navigate the open world of Aftermath, you need to be strategic and resourceful, scavenge for essential supplies and powerful weapons to defend yourself against the undead and other players. Shooter mechanics ensure that every encounter is a high stakes battle for the best gear, making every moment tense and exciting. Next on the list is Flag Wars, an action packed Roblox game where players engage in thrilling battles to capture enemy flags, unlock powerful weapons, and create strategic tunnels. Inspired by Stigmaster Luke's classic game, The Underground War, Flag Wars brings a fresh twist to the game genre while maintaining the core elements that the fans love. In Flag Wars, teamwork and strategy are crucial. Players can dig tunnels to navigate the battlefield stealthily, surprising opponents and gaining tactical advantages. And the next game on the list is Pet Sim- I'm just kidding, that game is mid at best. The actual next game on the list is Super Doom Spire, a modern and remastered version of the classic Roblox hit, Doom Spire Brick Battle. This revamped experience offers a variety of modes with different objectives, making the gameplay even more exciting and diverse. In Super Doom Spire, the main objective in most game modes is to destroy all opposing spawns and eliminate teams. However, in party modes and deathmatch, the goals shift, adding more variety and fun to the gameplay. The game features numerous items to unlock, each with unique features and abilities, except for reskins. Players can also collect different stickers to use as emotes or sprays, adding a personal touch to the game. Super Doom Spire introduces many new features not found in the original game. One of the standout additions is the currency called Crowns, which players can earn and spend in the shop to buy 
buy new items. The lobby itself is scattered with chests to collect, offering rewards and enhancing the sense of exploration. Moreover, the game includes multiple modes, maps for players to vote on, ensuring that the game, that every match feels fresh and engaging. Next up on the list is Fort Blocks. Now, this game is actually inspired by Fortnite, but I actually think it is very, very good. But I think it's actually a lot of fun, even though it's the Roblox version. In Fort Blocks, players begin each match by skydiving onto a sprawling map, setting the stage for an intense and action-packed battle royale experience. As soon as you land, the race is on to locate the powerful guns and essential gear scattered across the terrain. The primary objective in Fort Blocks is straightforward. Eliminate all the players to be the last one standing. The game emphasizes quick thinking and fast reflexes as you need to, as you need to gather weapons and resources rapidly while staying alert. The dynamic environment and strategic gameplay elements ensure that no two matches are the same, keeping the excitement levels high. The next game on the list is perfect for playing Roblox with your friends and emphasizing teamwork. The game is called Pull a Friend and the goal is to pull your friend to the end of the course. The ultimate cooperative adventure where you, you and a teammate navigate through challenging obstacle courses, while the other player strategically manages the brakes to control the cart speed. This requires excellent communication and coordination, making it a fantastic game for building teamwork skills and just playing with your friends. But watch out, treacherous obstacles lurk around every corner ready to knock you out and damage your precious cart. Stay sharp and work together to avoid these hazards and keep your cart in one piece. As you progress, you can unlock cart skins scattered around the map, adding a fun and customizable element to your adventure. Show off your unique style as you tackle each course. With every checkpoint you reach, your progress will autosave so you can pick up right where you left off if you need a break. So just real quick, I thought I would throw in one more game. This game I actually love to play a lot. I use it as a background footage in a lot of my videos, and this game is actually called Hill of Heck. And your objective is to make it to the bottom of the hill while jumping, sliding, and running through obstacles. There's a currency in the game that can be earned for playing rounds or getting to the very bottom of the hill. And there are tons of other in-game round modifiers and so much more that you can do within the game. There's trails. There's a lot in the game that makes it a lot of fun. So the controls are really simple to slide down the hill you click control and then to slide on walls you simply just jump and hold onto that wall the game is a whole lot of fun and i would recommend trying it out if you're looking for something completely different and new and fresh and i like to log on to this game every couple days and just play it for a bit just kind of sit and chill and just enjoy the moment it's a lot of fun and i would recommend playing it for yourself anyways guys that's pretty much it for the video but here are the top seven games that were listed in this video again if you want the game links you can go down to the website you have motorcycle mayhem untitled tag game shadovis aftermath flag wars Fort blocks pull a friend and hill of heck anyways guys please make sure to leave a like comment and subscribe and i'll see you guys in the next video